Good morning children today i am going to tell a story about the cunning snake are you all guys ready let's go there lived a brown snake by the name of manvishya near a pond the pond was full of frogs big and small they were all leading a happy life under the good rule of their king frog The big brown snake had become old and weak and could no more catch his prey easily for his meals so he decided to play a rush upon the frogs one day he went to the pond and lay there as if he was suffering from illness after some time he king frog happened to come out of water He saw the brown snake lying by the side of the pond in a pitiable condition. When he asked for the reason in a plated noun, the snake said, A week before, I bit the son of a pundit my mistake because he had tried to kill me with his stick. He said he died immediately. Now he pandit has cursed me according to his curse i ha- i will have to serve the frogs and how to eat whatever they offer me for food so i am here to serve you the king frog and his mistakes were delighted to hear this other frogs also gathered around the snake many of the ministers frogs and the king frog to jump it onto the back of the brown snake to have a joy ride the brown snake swam round the pond with all the frogs riding on his back the next day also the frogs rode over the entire length of the snake's back the snake saw in the pond soon the king frog realized that the snake's moment hard slowed down when he asked for the reason the brown snake said you majesty do it you cannot swimming and no availability of food i have grown weak i cannot move any more the king frog thinking that is view of the snake's physical weakness he must not be able to have joy ride in future allowed the snake to eat a few frogs the brown snakes they started eating the frogs easily one by one one day there were no frogs left in the pond except the king frog so the snake spoke to the king frog i cannot remain hungry any more there are no frogs now left in the pond except you So please excuse me for eating you and the brown snake attacked the frog with a lightning speed and ate him also dear children the moral of the story is never trust your enemy did you all like the story next day i will tell you another story